I'm going to Caitlin Bend. Today's been a really boring, and not, not a frustrating day, but a downer of a day. Um, you know, I just, I didn't want to do anything today. And the fact that I had to do stuff before I could go to Taylor Bend was like, uh, you know. Don't get me wrong, I didn't have to do the stuff, but I'd rather go out around the house and do it. But, uh, you know, whatever. Anyway, so this was bad bay. Oh, actually, no, 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 I forgot. This morning I had a good morning. I, uh, blew money I didn't have. Oh, I mean, I had it. Oh, I shouldn't have, shouldn't have spent it. But I did buy it for the long run. So I've got two beautiful saddlebags. They're 43 litre saddlebags. Do they suit my bike? No. Are they made for my bike? No. Do they work? Yep. Because they're a, um, a throw over saddlebag. You know, they've got two straps over the seat. So I put one strap under the seat and one strap over the seat. And then pretty much right there they're locked in place, but they still flap around a little bit. So. No, I'd done a few things and made it so they were more secure. No zip ties, nothing, just straps that were on the bag. Um, yeah, my poor Grom. It's got quite a bit of weight in this bike, and it's not exactly a fast bike. And with my sleeping bag and my little tent, I also bought a little tent, and 5.5 litres of fuel, and Oh, you name it. It's, you know, I don't need all this stuff because, well, I don't. I'm just testing it out to see how good my bike does. Yeah, it does pretty poorly, but I mean, it's a grom. I mean, what do you expect? And this bad boy has done 31,000 kilometers, and I'm going to keep going. I always get to my destination just a lot slower than other people will. You know, it doesn't matter. And um, now I'm going to Taylor and Ben. Yay! So I booked the caravan park off Howard Place. So, yeah. I could have picked on. I feel like I should have done Howard, but it doesn't matter. And um, I'm going to set up my tent, put my luggage bags in the tent when I'm, you know, the next morning comes around. Um, yeah, man, you know. Pretty, pretty happy, just happy to be on the road and then in a proper road trip too. Oh, it just feels good, man. It just feels good. I might only be doing like uh, I'm always five kilometers ahead, so I might only be doing like 95 kilometers in 110 zone. But it doesn't matter. Sometimes this thing drops down to like 90, and then I think, oh shit, that's pretty bad. But that's when I go uphill. When I go downhill, I do about 110, 115. The weight really does affect the bike. <laughs> and this was a fun bike. But hey, I'd easily go to here in Mount Gambia any time. Just good to be on the road on a long trip. Sure, my neck will hurt eventually. Who gives a shit? But, um, oh, and I hope my sister gets better. Um, she, and uh, Jerome and Angie have a scooter, like an electric scooter. And, uh, you know how scooters like fold in half? Yeah, it got a bit loose and apparently it folded up when she was riding her scooter, which isn't funny, but it's pretty funny. Um, but she was pretty hurt. So, uh, I hope she gets better. They're going to the hospital. Apparently, I went to the doctor. The doctor's like, no, no, go to the hospital. So, he drove to it and he paid 80 bucks for it. Eh, I don't know, go to the hospital. Like, I could have done that. Stupid diagnosis, he says. Um, yeah, see, this is going uphill. I'm doing like 85 kilometers. Pretty upsetting, but it's a Grom. And let's be, let's face it, I always redline the Grom. So it's not the healthiest Grom. Um, if I back it up in here, though, I'm going to go dramatically slow, I reckon. Okay. Yeah, anyway, I better get off the uh, recording device. But, um, yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I don't know. Have a good time, I hope. Tomorrow involves brekkie, and then a conference, and then 
after the conference we get to go on the racing track but it's not a track day it is a cruise but for 40 bucks I get to cruise around the racetrack so I can't complain last time I saw someone cruise around a racetrack with racing vehicles they got, in England they got like a $8,000 fine in 4 years in prison I mean, I mean they were pretty dumb they took their Volkswagen Polo onto a racetrack and uh, there are racing cars and everything but yeah hey it's a Jim's inspection Jim's hey Jim's I wanna catch it! No, oh, I'm not gonna do it! No! I've got a gym to play a bike! Fuck! Okay, I'm gonna stop talking now. I've been talking for a while. Oh. Anyway, uh, I hope I have fun tomorrow. Angelina, I hope you get better. Angelina and Jerome, I hope that your cleaning goes well. We've been screwed around too much. Uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, my dad got second in lawnmower racing, and then he's racing again tomorrow. Because, uh, you know, yeah. Anyway, bye!